Yo, what's going on guys? It's Lazy from Cash Gang here and today I want to make a no cap Rilo Rodriguez NBA young boy type beat like I always do. I laid down some chords, they sound like this, I'll go over processing in a minute. Really, really simple because it doesn't need to be too complicated. Some basic effects, I got noise suppressor, I might turn that up a little bit actually. Um, but I don't like turning it up too far because it takes some of the high end out and I really like the high end on guitar Like I boosted it there just because it takes it out, but it sounded good there So but I took some lows out stereo shaper like this effects rack I was just watching stuff and I saw on some video someone use this and I thought it sounded really really good So I've decided to add it on and it adds like a little vintage thing to it and it sounds quite nice And then I had some uh, vintage verb just has it as it opens up and I just turned it down on the mix here without effects It sounds like this You can tell the difference however, I did record with this amp on but yeah, I'm gonna record some counter melodies I'm actually gonna pull up my phone and I'm gonna record my guitar because I know people like to see what you're playing as well. So, all right, so I'm gonna lay down some um, counter melodies. <laughs> Little tip first, you wanna try and find the scale. So, you play the melody. Find one note that like just goes with every chord. So, like this one. And that will be the root note and then that way you find the scale then i like to use the pentatonic scale everyone likes to use a pentatonic scale if you're not on the pentatonic scale then uh just research it and learn it uh because it's the best scale for these type of melodies in my opinion that you can add filler notes i don't know music very too much i just know the basics all i know is that you got the pentatonic scale which is And then you've got notes that you can do in between, like this way we can add some nice counters. So, so literally basic like that. I always add this one in. You can learn little riffs and stuff. So as you can tell, that is not in time. And FL has this cool plugin called New Time. A lot of guitar producers don't like it, but because it makes it sound a bit weird, but I don't mind it because I know it just makes my life easier. So yeah, we just basically make sure every note's hitting at the right time, which I didn't play this part too bad, but I know the second part is terrible. Plus you can just quantize it with uh, Command Q, Control Q if you're on Windows, I think. Anyway, let me sort this part out. See that I don't want that hitting there. Okay, that'll do for now. can add more stuff another tip for guitar melodies is when you can try and harmonize with your counters sometimes it, it gives a cool effect other times it can sound a bit weird but most of the time it sounds pretty good
obviously to the melodies we just added uh, we want to make sure they're in time <laughs> Now I'm gonna take my headphones off actually and uh, try and level it with on my monitors because I don't use my headphones too much so I'm not very good at leveling. <laughs> I'm gonna mute the microphone. I added a shaper box onto one of the counter melodies. I think it was this one. I, I took it off because I didn't need it anymore and it was just using CPU that I didn't want to use. Um, just like as I've turned the effects off so it doesn't use that extra CPU that, yeah, because my computer can't handle anything right now. I added shaper box on, put this cool reverse effect on that I've started doing and I rendered it out on its own track so I can have control over mixing it and stuff. And I pitched it down. Originally I pitched it up but I didn't end up liking the sound of it. So I pitched it down, EQ'd it and added a bunch of reverb. So yeah, now it sounds pretty good to me, I think so we can get started on the drums. Thank you. 
Yo guys, so that is the beat. Kits are down in the description. Drum kit, just released a loop kit with BL Beats. Let me know what you want me to do in the comments. Do you want me to break down songs that I've done? Follow my Instagram, subscribe, so and I'll see you next time.